What's up, what's up, what's up? Sir, dabs a lot here, dabbing on the haters. But you can't see me dabbing, but I just did. Anyway, I have, I'm gonna do uh, two canvas. I'm gonna do this one with primary colors, red, blue, and yellow. And then this one is gonna be secondary, green, orange, and purple. So basically, I'm gonna show you how I mix them into the cup. And I'm thinking I'm gonna go with the uh, swirl technique today. The swirl pour re Anyway, yeah, let's just get started. Let's, I'm gonna go ahead and, well, I'll wait to do that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna mix the primary colors up here first. Red, blue, and yellow, everybody. I'm gonna bring a cup up here just to, to kinda see how I'm mixing them. I really don't know how I'm gonna mix them. I'm gonna go red first, though. I should probably not do this over the canvases, but you know what? I like to take risks sometimes. <laughs> Oh yeah. So, again, I'm mixing primary color. Ooh. You, back the red. you should look in this. Yeah, you should already look. Well, no, that's fine. There's already stuff going on in this cup. Like cells, like crazy. I'm gonna do yellow. I'm, I'm doing it differently. This yellow is actually looking really cool, just in this cup. I don't know if you guys can see that, but probably not. Oh yeah. Save a little bit red on the top there. Get crazy with it. <laughs> Definitely gonna have enough paint. I can't I don't even know. You should look and see if I'm even on screen with this right now. Because I've been doing it up here most of the time. Okay, I just didn't know if I was on camera or not. Thank you. Okay. So, just about got all my primary mix. my first cup, my primary colors everybody. Now we're gonna go secondary, green, orange, and purple. You know, I think I'm gonna start just that same order. This is fun you guys, like I really think I'm addicted to acrylic pouring now. I mean I guess it's a pretty good addiction but at the same time it's not so if anybody wants to sponsor me so I don't have to pay for all my paint that would be amazing too uh, email me at my business email in my profile mm -hmm. mixing the secondaries up the orange is kind of taking over my cup it's a little more I think a little more runny, but you know, it won't come out looking like that. Just put it all in there. I like how the uh, primary colors mix in the cup. about the same amount in each cup. So there is my secondary colors and my primary colors mixed into the cup. So now what we're gonna do is now we're gonna have some fun you guys. We're gonna watch the magic happen. First I'm gonna go ahead and just put some of this white I got mixed. I might have got it a little thin but basically all I did, I didn't actually didn't explain what I did, you guys. Basically, 
I actually used Elmer's glue and dish soap on this one. So basically got one part glue, so that would be your glue, and one part paint, so even amount, equal amount of paint and glue. And then basically I just take a little dish soap with a little water into it and then dump it in after it's all mixed up and thin it down. But I got a little too thin, but basically that's my how-to. Okay, I'm just going to dump this on each just to get it nice and slick so the paint flows because I don't have flow troll, which is amazing in paintings. But uh, we're doing the Elmer's glue. So let's just see how. Yeah, it's really, really thin there. But that's okay because you know what? It'll cover it really easily. And that's basically what I need right now, actually. You know, let's just go ahead and use the rest of it. Might as well. Boop. I could have put some white in these cups, but I didn't. Normally I'd use a brush, but this time I'm just going to do that, because I still got to put the paint on top. Just making sure it's nice and covered to everybody. Get it nice and sleek, you know, just like Bob Ross. Get it nice and sleek, wet and ready to go. Anyway, I got paint all over my hands now. So, let's just do this. I am, once again, I'm doing the swirl. I'm going to just kind of swirl it as I go down and see what happens. Oh, yeah. I must say, I like it so far. Really liking it a lot. Still got a lot of paint in this cup. Man, I don't want to go back up here, but I am. Definitely got it really slick, but that's okay. Don't want to drip anything on there, but. It does happen. Just covering in all the, whoops, I did drip some on the other one. That's not good. Now we're mixing primary with secondary. Okay, I like this area right here for sure. We got some cells coming up in here. All right. Let's check out the sides real quick. Yep. I wish I had a towel or something. Oh, I like this side over here. Hmm? Alright. <clears throat> it has got some cells in it though. And the more I manipulate, the more I see them. 
Look at them color cells. Okay, so this is my primary. Oh, thank you, babe. My primary colors. Next, we're going with the secondary. And I hope it comes out as cool as the first one. Okay, I'm gonna go on this side. All right, let's look cool. Okay, I think the orange is gonna take over a lot on this one. Definitely got the orange way too thin. I got them both really thin, but like I'm still learning, so that's fine. There we go, I got some of the purple coming in there. So, lumpy. So these are my secondary colors. Green, orange, and purple. Alright. Okay, that's kind of cool how they mixed in though. primary colors there. That's what I need to do. Just covering up my edges here. I'm trying to use the same color, you know what I mean? Okay. Wish I would have kept some more of the orange up here, but And like I said, they will look completely different tomorrow. You can get this side down here. Okay, I didn't see that. Thank you. And down here. And it'll still drip, though. I mean, it'll still come off and roll a little more, you know what I mean? Like, maybe not right there, actually. So that's pretty good that you showed me that. And right here. pick up some of that blue because I want to mix the primary with secondary. <sighs> Alright, you guys. So, let me come back here and look at this. Okay, I'm loving the primary colors. Like, they mix in really awesome. Like, you guys can't really probably tell like I can, but I'll do a close-up. This one, eh. That's got a little of the stuff going on, the orange and the green, but not much. And then you can kind of fade into some purples. Kind of hard to tell, but I guess I'll see what it looks like tomorrow. I'm trying to see if any of that orange will come through. But it's not. So, I'll just leave it be. Yeah. Alright, you guys. I'll do a little close-up here, and we'll call it good. Okay, let's come in here. Get this close-up. Hmm, yeah. Oh yeah, I'm loving the primary colors. Red, blue, and yellow, everybody. That come okay, yeah, this is the area. I'm like oh, I'm loving this area right here. That looks amazing. Oh yeah. Primary came out really awesome. Let's see here. We got our secondary colors. 
That looks pretty cool. They got some cells going on, some little lacing deals or whatever. It's different. It's definitely different. I do say I got it a little thin, but it's fine. Yeah, that's my primary colors, my secondary colors. Everybody, please hit that thumbs up. It's much appreciated. And share this video. And have a good one. Peace out, everybody, and dab out.